There's no doubt that Kevin Costner had a huge part in the success of Yellowstone as a series. He's the first actor that signed in the show and was one of the main reasons why people wanted to invest in the project and turn it into a reality rather than an idea in Taylor Sheridan's notebook. In a way, he was the first one who believed in the project. He saw the potential and didn't hesitate to put effort into it, which is impressive. However, five years later, we are at a point where his potential departure from the show can bring the show to an early ending. This sounds horrible for any fans out there, we know that. But now facing such a possibility, we feel like it's time to discuss what to do to minimize the damage of Costner's departure. There might be millions of theories on how to save the Yellowstone franchise. However, none of them is as efficient as having a prequel series with Josh Lucas in our opinion, as he is the only one who embraces the spirit of John Dutton as well as Costner. Lucas has been playing the part of young John Dutton since the beginning of the original Yellowstone series. Because Yellowstone is a very complex family drama with lots of nuances, it's crucial to show the emotional baggage of every single character and why they are the way they are today. Of course, Sheridan could always choose to make them tell a story about their past, but as you all know, the first rule of the cinema is to show not tell. Thus, he wisely chose flashbacks instead, in which he introduced the younger versions of our current characters. Normally, any characters in flashback scenes are usually overlooked by the general audience, as they are seen as mere tools to make a point rather than having your own personalities. To be honest, for the most part, this is a valid argument for the majority of the flashback characters in Yellowstone as well. However, Lucas poses an exception. He stands out with his unique performance that not only captures the essence of John Dutton, but also doesn't get overshadowed by the huge presence of Costner. That's to stay, when we are watching him, we believe that he is John Dutton for sure, but we don't see him as the Walmart version of Costner by any means. One of the reasons why he is so successful in playing the part is that Lucas is already a well-known successful actor with lots of remarkable projects on his resume. So he isn't a newbie in the sector who might simply have preferred to copy what Costner does. 